hello everyone hello 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 welcome back to my channel today it is the 5th of may 2023 it's friday evening it's half past six and i'm just now settling in to watch some live grand prix action uh it's practice one and two tonight because it's friday um and uh and as they're in America, it's on in the evenings, so I can actually watch it live. Usually when it's in Europe, the sessions are on during the day, so I have to catch up with them after work. So this is kind of like a normal situation, but a little bit different because I'm watching it live. They're in Miami this weekend, and uh, I feel like it's a bit more of a spectacle because like all the celebs go to Miami. But I think it'll probably be even worse when they go to Las Vegas later on in this year, but... Yeah, that is what we're doing. Um, I'm going to vlog throughout this weekend. Monumental moment in our lives. So the plan is that tomorrow I will be going to my parents. So I don't think I'll be vlogging much, but I'm going to go to my parents to watch the coronation live. And then there may be like a street party sort of vibe as well that I might stay for. And then I'm going to come home in the early afternoon to watch the F1 qualifying and then Sunday um I don't have much plans and I don't have any plans on Monday either so I am just kind of sorting things out really oh the sun's coming out it was it's, it's raining but the sun's coming out that's interesting that really just distracted me anyway yeah so not really got much planned so i don't really know what i'm going to share with you or what the premise of this vlog is really going to be showing and sharing um i've got a lot of like admin to do um i need to book my cat in for when i go on my holiday in september I just managed to book her and find a place that will accept her in July which is good now September I need to then try and find somewhere else for that and yeah it's all it's all going on really it's just a lot of sort of trying to sort of things out so that is the plan so I'm gonna watch some of this F1 now and then uh, I think I'll probably make some dinner whilst it's all in the background. I'm currently in the process of doing like an elimination diet just to see what foods really kind of like set off my IBS stuff. That's like, you know, the basic foods rather than like specific foods. Um, so I'm currently cutting out gluten, uh, dairy, soy and egg. I'm on day 10 right now, so I've gone 10 days without them, which is pretty good going so far. So I need to wait up until I think 24, 25 days and then see if I have a reaction to them or not. Um, so tomorrow is the first day where I'm actually leaving my house and going somewhere else. They'll probably provide me with tea with no normal milk in it, which won't be ideal. That is what's going to happen. I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. I don't know if I will vlog tonight. I think this is kind of like an intro just to the vlog. But I will probably catch up with you guys tomorrow. Maybe tonight if I want to share what I'm cooking. But really I'm going to start this off tomorrow. I know it's kind of like 50-50. Some people don't like the royals. Some do. I, I like them. I do like it. I think it's fascinating to watch all of it. I know that we kind of pay for everything that they do, but um, I just love all the fanfare for it. You know what I mean? If I lived in London, I would 100% be there. That's the situation. Um, yeah, I've got nothing else to say. No, nothing else to say. I'm going to go and watch some F1. Good morning. Happy coronation day of King Charles the third. Anyway, um, I'm actually in a bit of a rush, but uh, it's also a bit of a rush with me these days. Um, I'm going to do my makeup now. This is not what I'm going to wear today, but I just put it on this morning because I'm a little bit cold. But the plan of action today is I'm going to my mum and dad's for the coronation ceremony watching. 
and then probably like a street party thing in the afternoon don't really know if i'm going to go to that or not i wanted to show you guys this that i've made so i'm currently doing like an elimination diet thing and i'm currently on phase one phase one is to be gluten free dairy free soy free and egg free i've been doing this now for 11 days now i think which is pretty good going and uh yeah i think i've got i'm like halfway through halfway through this first phase um i think it's like day 22 or day 23 around that time where i can then incorporate dairy back in though i have a feeling that today i might be doing that because i am leaving the house and i don't know if i'll have any options but anyway this is a smoothie bowl that i've just made it's got strawberries it's got almond milk it's got raspberries it's got banana and then i just put some granola on top of it 40 minutes until i need to leave to go to my parents so we're on a little bit of a time crunch but we shall see how it goes so i'm pretty much ready to go now um i've managed to get my makeup on in 20 minutes which is actually pretty fast um that's back to like how long it would take me in the mornings before i started going to the office now usually my makeup takes like an hour to do because i don't have those like limitations i need to leave my flat in about 10 minutes so um i think i'm going to wrap my dad's present up again because i did rebuy his present i got him like an ipad cover but the ipad cover was the wrong size for the ipad i've got the same exact ipad as him and I bought a new iPad case that work, that fits on mine, so it will fit on his. So we're going to go and take that over to them as well. Yeah, I haven't seen them in a few weeks because they went to Cyprus. I'm glad that they're now back home. Alright, I'll see you guys later. Okay, I'm now back home. Just got home in time to watch the F1. So I did fail. I did fail my diet. I didn't want. I didn't want to stay there for lunch, but I ended up staying there for some food, like a little bit of food. And I had coronation chicken, which had mayonnaise in it. And I had a cup of tea, which had milk in it. And then I had a pavlova, which obviously has egg in it. Um, and I even brought home some coronation chicken that I'm going to eat for dinner tonight. Coronation chicken actually really really nice and I've got a whole pot of it here it is using I think there's like curry powder in it mayonnaise there's some wine there's like some sort of sauce that my mum made some onion I don't know it's delicious though so that is what I'm gonna probably have for dinner and yeah I'm gonna call this a proper cheat day so I watched it at my parents we now have a King Charles, the weather was atrocious and then I went out for that little street party. We had a bit of a disaster with the gazebo, um, which is actually my parents, where it was raining so much that the water was collecting on the roof and um, like we had to keep on like um, somehow getting it off because if it got too heavy it will either stretch the fabric or it will you know fall through and it was a little bit scary but yeah uh, it was quite nice um the food was nice some pulled pork as well which probably has some sort of cream in it as well so yeah so far i'm feeling okay though i also had a alcohol free corona and that also has like gluten in it so yeah, I'm basically just kind of saying that today is a write-off of my elimination diet and um, we're just going to carry on tomorrow as if nothing happened. Uh, by the way, I really, really loved that smoothie bowl I made this morning. I think that's going to be my uh, breakfast for the next couple of weeks. So I'm going to buy some more like raspberries and strawberries tomorrow. Um, probably going to actually package it a little bit differently because they are getting rock solid in the pots i had them in so i think i'm going to try and find some like food bags and then like put them in my freezer that way so that they're not too clumped up because i found it really difficult to like cut them away this morning so yeah i'm a little bit tired 
Um, do I need to film anything? I don't think I need to film anything this weekend, apart from this vlog. So I think we're all good. We're all good and gravy. I'm still like thinking about my streaming, by the way, which I think I'm going to probably start later on in the year, um, towards the end of it or maybe even next year. I need to buy all of the things. I need to buy the um, a camera. I need to buy like an additional screen. I don't really have like a specific place I can actually stream from at the moment. Um, unless I just like use my desk where I work and just like change things over and make it work for a stream, um, which I might do, you know. Um, but then I need to buy some cables to make it work with this laptop because I'm gonna, if I do stream, I'm gonna stream from this and um, yeah, all of those things. Any, oh, ow, <laughs> anyway, that is my update. I'm Good morning guys, I'm wearing the same hoodies yesterday because why not? It's actually uh, 20 to 11. Oh, my, brain, my watch has died. Uh, it's 20, past 20 to 11. It is Sunday? Yes, Sunday. And um, I have started, or I've made myself another little smoothie bowl. Um, I used like one of those pre-made mixtures. I didn't really mix as well as like the strawberries, raspberries and bananas does. I used some of these, but for some reason it just did not want to break up these pieces. So it took some like time and effort, more effort than I needed to. It's got quite thick. So I probably won't do that again once I finished the other packet. Um, it's actually too cold because obviously it's frozen. So whilst I'm doing that, I am currently doing some washing up. Um, I probably won't do it all now, I'll probably do some of it later. And um, whilst I'm doing this elimination diet, technically I'm gonna be failing it again today because I do have leftover chicken from yesterday. I tried to have some of it last night, um, didn't finish it all because I wasn't really hungry last night. I realized at like midnight I hadn't had dinner. So I just had like a few mouthfuls of that just to keep me going. And yeah, so I am going to be still cheating today, um, but that's the only thing I'll cheat on, I think. Uh, what was I doing my tangent on? I can't remember. What was I, where was I going with that? I'm not too sure. So yeah, I'm going to probably make myself a coffee. And I've been trying to figure out how to have almond milk without it like separating. And they say to put the almond milk in first and then pour in the warm or hot drink afterwards and then that should not make it separate. So I'm going to try that today. Um, if you wonder what coffee I use, it kind of changes. I don't really have a specific brand I'm going after. But I'm using Alfie Day's coffee at the moment. Just out of, I don't know, intrigue. So I've got two that I opened over there. I've got Focus. So I've, got, so I've got these two, which are unopened, which are the Focus and Share ones. And then I've got this one, which I think is called Everyday. And then I've got this one, which is Reset, which is Decaf. Um, these don't have labels on them. The only way you can know what they are is by these things being stapled onto them. So um, I'm trying not to lose them all. <laughs> So yeah, I haven't tried these two yet because I don't have enough space in my freezer. Is it weird actually that I keep my coffee in the freezer? Um, I was taught like so many years ago that that's where you meant to leave it. It doesn't freeze, but it meant, it's meant to like keep it for longer. The reason why I'm having coffee, by the way, is because I can't stand the taste of tea with almond milk. So the way I'm like going around that and having, still having a warm drink is by in fact having coffee instead because I haven't minded the taste in coffee. I also have noticed that I don't mind having black coffee as well. I can't stand black tea. So, <coughs> I mean black, I can't stand black tea without milk. So this is another way around that I've been trying to figure out how I can have what I wanna have without it being an issue. Forgot to film it, but here is the coffee. Um, I'm actually deciding to have it just black. And unlike tea, I have to have sugar with my tea with my coffee. 
So, I'm going to have some brown sugar. I managed to wean myself off sugar in tea like five years ago, whenever I moved into this flat. I managed to wean myself off it. Haven't managed to get to that point with coffee, and I think it's because I use, or I, it's because I have coffee less often. Uh, I have coffee like once a week. Um, I'm having it a lot more at the moment because uh, of my diet and um, the fact that I can't have black tea. It just doesn't taste nice. So. So unfortunately, still gonna have a really sweet cup of coffee. The, it's all right, I've only got two more weeks and then I can uh, bring back in dairy and have normal milk again. So, I mean, it's quite nice to like try it out, I guess. This gives me an option to like try out different milks again. I know I don't like coconut milk, so I'm not even bothering to try that. I mean, I like coconut milk in the sense of like condensed coconut milk you know for cooking but not coconut milk that you have for drinking or other purposes um oat milk i can't remember i feel like it quite it felt quite heavy but i think that would be quite good i'm nearly finishing with my almond milk so once i have like a couple more of my morning smoothies i'll be able to finish my almond milk and then move over to my oat milk um the oat milk i have in question is this one here I thought I'd try it and see how it goes. But still, my favorite go-to uh, alternative milk is soy milk, which I'm cutting out at the moment. So, we shall see how it goes. So, I have been just sitting, twiddling, well, make, doing my nails for the last couple of hours. I'm gonna have the leftover coronation chicken because it is full of dairy. So I need to eat it up so I can continue on with my plan tomorrow. So yeah, um, usually on some days I go food shopping and I haven't actually done that today because it's a bank holiday Monday tomorrow. I thought maybe I'll just go food shopping tomorrow instead. So that's what I'm doing. I'm taking today's completely chill. I'm really tired. Um, don't really know why. I'm just like constantly tired. Um, I, might also, I might also do my makeup and see how that's going to go. Real talk. Um, I have my lunch. Went into my room to like read a little bit. Fell asleep for the last like three hours. Perfect. Um, I have been battling with like a headache, migraine, neck pain all week. And it's still here. Nothing seems to be making it better. I don't know if it's the lack of the food that I'm usually having that it doesn't like or what. But I'm struggling and I've just woken up with like another headache. I feel like it's like another migraine, which is not ideal. And I don't know why it keeps happening, but I am in like severe pain. I'm gonna take some ibuprofen now, because I think I'm at the start of it, rather than in the middle. Um, I always get them, um, first thing when I wake up. So I'm gonna have a pink one. Please well. May show you drows drowsiness. Let's hope it's not showing me drowsiness. I'm gonna have a snack. Anyway. Um so yeah. Wow. Well, is happening hello everyone um so real talk i kind of forgot that i was meant to be vlogging this weekend so it's now half past two it is sunday and i'm kind of just like chilling i'm gonna go food shopping in a little bit i'm actually watching the coronation of king and queen uh i already watched it but i recorded it and i missed like the first three hours because i got up late and went to my mum and dad's instead um so i'm catching up where i missed off i want to caught up where i was then i think i will go food shopping but i don't know I've st i think i've still got like another hour and a half it's 2 30 now i'm feeling like it might be a little bit busy so i might go in like another hour 
and go food shopping and then I want to come home probably do a workout I want to have a bath like so bad so bad my hair is so greasy um and then see what I'm gonna do for the rest of the day I actually want to watch the concert I haven't seen the concert yet so I plan to watch that today as well um, but this morning I got up at 8 o'clock in the morning and I cleaned my flat. I mean, it doesn't look like it's very clean, I'm not gonna lie. But I did dust around and I did hoover the entire flat and it feels much nicer. My uh, hoover needed to be emptied three times. And I've got a small flat and that's because of my cat and her hair everywhere um i've also put new bed sheets on so i'm feeling like you know today's a good day um, i feel accomplished i did have plans to have like this really excellent like good vlog but the weather has just not been it again today it's cloudy overcast not very inviting um yesterday it was raining the day before it was raining so yeah i mean it's kind of like a basic bank holiday weekend for me where I've got no plans because I'm a bully no mates. I'll see you guys in my next clip where I hopefully don't look as shiny as I do. It might not have looked like I have been anywhere but I have been to Tesco. Shop bags down there. Let me just take my shoes off. It wasn't too bad actually. I guess because it was bank holiday Monday people are actually not really wanting to leave their homes while they're doing other stuff but the Tesco that I frequent it's not too bad but shall I show you guys what I have got um some of these don't fit my elimination diet but they're kind of like um refills for when my uh phase one ends so this is a prime example this is a Costa coffee uh, latte thing that I can use in my Dolce uh, Gusto thing. Got some watercress to make with a salad of some sort. Got some plastic bags for food, and I plan to put my raspberries and strawberries in here, separate them into different bags, and then have them as servings for my smoothies over the next coming week um we've got some british lean diced beef some spaghetti refill because mine's going a little bit low uh maple syrup and pecan peanuts bar things um we have got some nochi I didn't actually check if I can have this. May contain soy. So it's a may contain, so it should be okay. Strawberries. Orange juice. Bananas. That's a fucking bad one. Bad two. Razor crisps as they seem to be the only thing that don't include for sure any of the things I need to have. So it says may contain and I'm allowing that. Like if it's a may contain, I'm feeling that's fine. So oil files I'm running out. Smoked salmon. Raspberries for the smoothies. Uh, some pecan nuts because they are my snacks these days. Um, I'll try some bacon rashes that are poison free. So, gluten free, wheat free, and milk free. So, calling that a win. Um, so, I would try this. This is some Alpro strawberry uh, plant based naturally lactose free yogurt. Oh, it includes soy. When's this best before? 29. Oh, that's fine. 29 from May, that's ages away. Okay, I can actually do that, that's fine. I'll be finished with this phase one by then. 
and avocado. Um, that's really annoying. I really wanted to have some yogurt, but I guess I can't have that now. So yeah, it doesn't look like it's a lot of food, but as I said, I am a one person living under this roof and I kind of only need like one meal to get me through, a, well, well two main meals to get me through a week. All right, my neck is killing me, so I think I'm gonna have a bath now. Um, today's just been like flying by. It's already like 20 past five. So I'm doing my bath. I was gonna do like a filming session. Maybe I'll still do it, maybe later on tonight. So I do plan to have a bath and I do plan to put makeup on because I wanna film some videos that I need to post in the next couple of weeks. Uh, but I don't need to, but they are what was in the plan to upload. Anyway, so um, I'm gonna have a bath now. That'll probably take like an hour. And then I will uh, probably do my makeup and film something on this big old boy, which by the way, I dropped the other day, or this fell over. And then it like started bugging out, but it seems to have fixed itself. So that was quite a scary moment. Otherwise I'd be filming all my main videos on this little Canon uh, G7X, which you know, it is a great camera, but um, you know, I haven't had any issues with it, you know? So um, I forgot to buy more alternative milks. So I've got orange juice in my tea. That's not my tea. I just got orange juice in my mug. Is what I meant to say. Um, yes, I'm going to. I'm going to have the bath because uh, my hair is greasy and I love baths. And I'm probably going to catch up on some YouTube whilst I'm at it. Um, I haven't watched the Coronation concert yet. I'm probably going to do that as my evening entertainment. Right, shower done. It's actually already 7 p.m. and. The light is going down, it's getting dark. So I'm going to put you guys on time lapse and whiz through doing my makeup. I hope I can do it before like it gets too dark. Um, and then I'll film some videos in the sunset. Whether they appear on YouTube or not is yet to be decided. Um, I actually film I actually filmed a lot more videos than I upload. The screen does not really show you how dark it is. Um, wait. I want to say it's like that dark right now. I put you on like a minus two point something ISO. <laughs> so yeah. So yeah. Um, Alright, let's do this before the sun sets and it gets too dark.